Hi, I'm Dr. Mark B. Hubble, and this is your Monday Morning Mini Message. You know, as a spiritual leader and someone involved in the ministry, I always feel like I have this added pressure on me to be perfect in everything I do and everything I say. And it causes me a lot of stress. It causes me a lot of anxiety because there are areas in my life that I'm going to fall short in on a daily basis. And it's difficult for me to overcome these things. But Paul was a great example of somebody who almost kind of embraced that imperfection. He said that he had a thorn in his flesh, and that was some kind of sin, a thought or behavior that he kept having all the time, and he couldn't seem to shake it. And he asked God to remove it from him, but he still ended up having it. And what he realized was that one thing, that thorn, or whatever it is, it wasn't specified exactly what it is. He never uh, clarified it. But what it was, was a way for him to be humbled because people looked up to him, because people followed him, because people listened to him and respected the things that he had to say when it came to his knowledge of the gospel. It was a way to be humbled. In the second book of Corinthians, chapter 12, verse 10, Paul talks about this. He says, that is why for Christ's sake, I delight in my weaknesses and persecutions and difficulties and insults and hardships, because when I am weak, then I am strong. He's saying that his weakness is his need to have God, his need to have a savior, his need to have someone to cry out to in those moments of imperfection, in those moments where he falls short, because that is how he knows that God is working in his life. I know that in my life, you know, there's areas I'm going to fall short in. So people that may watch this message or may look up to me in a certain way as being a spiritual leader, please understand that you're looking up to a human being. You're looking up to a flawed person who has their own issues that they deal with. Now, I try to do the right thing at all times, but when I fall short, that's when I fall back on that verse and know that I serve a God who is forgiving, but I also know that I'm a human being that's capable of making mistakes, making bad choices, and falling short in my spiritual life. So that is why I always make it a point to pray every day to try to resist those temptations and to try to be the best person that I can be but also knowing that those thorns in my flesh are ways that keep me humble and needing a God of my understanding. So think about this as you go about your week. Whatever situation you're in, whatever flaws you have, whatever areas you fall short in, don't beat yourself up for it, but use it as an opportunity to try to grow and improve in every aspect of your life. Thank you for sharing this time with me. Take care and God bless.